profile customizes BricsCAD for the way you like to have it, such as which toolbars you want to see, the color of the screen, and some of the other things we've been talking about in this series on using the settings dialog box. Profiles are particularly useful if you've got more than one person using BricsCAD on a computer, and you each want to use BricsCAD according to the way you like it. You start BricsCAD with your personal profile. When BricsCAD starts up, it displays the welcome screen, and in the bottom third, it shows the five most recently accessed profiles. Now, BricsCAD comes with a number of preset profiles. You click on Profile Presets to see them. So, for example, you want to start a BIM drawing, but you want to use metric units of centimeters. So you choose the units there, click on BIM, and if you want, you can customize the name, say metric, click OK and now it's been added to the list of most recently used ones. Choose it and then select new drawing and BricsCAD opens up in the BIM workspace. To create a user profile, basically you set up BricsCAD the way you want to work with it and then you save it as it is. And here's the list of all the things that are saved in a user profile. So for example, right click a toolbar and then choose the toolbars you want to be able to see when you open BricsCAD. Or go into settings and adjust all the settings to the way you like to see them. Once you have BricsCAD the way you want it, you go into tools and then choose user profile manager. Then create click and then give it a name, my user profile. Okay. And then you can set current or else start BricsCAD anew with that profile. So there's my user profile, new drawing, and there's a second copy of BricsCAD open with your new profile. It might seem that user profiles are an awful lot like workspaces, but workspaces don't store settings. But the primary reason you'd use a user profile is to be able to export it and import it. This means you can use your profile on other computers running BricsCAD. Here's how to do that. From the user profile manager, choose the profile you want to export, click export, and then save the file. Notice it's an ARG file. So I'm clicking save. And now I switch over to the other computer and I run the user profile manager again with the profile manager command. Click import. There's my profile. Click open and BricsCAD is instantly reconfigured to meet my preferred settings.